Hi guys, um, I got myself a new camera. I've just got to buy a little stand for it, but uh, hopefully my video is going to be a little better. Um, this here is my latest unit I've painted up. This is the French, uh, sorry, Russian Cavalier Guard um, Crassier unit. Um, this is sort of like the uh, premier unit of the Russian Guard Cavalry of Pioneer Wars. Uh, a mate of mine um, here, we play quite a lot of Ponyx, um, General D'Army in the club um, and the Wild Geese. Which we um, we play a lot of uh, General D'Army, um, the new rules. Um, really enjoyable and a mate of mine, he, he plays the French um, and he's he loves his French uh, guard horse grenadiers, which he's got a beautifully painted unit of them. And um, he just he's puts them down the table and everyone sort of shakes in their boots a bit. But um, so I decided to paint these up to fight against them. So I'll try to zoom in this camera. I have got no instructions and I'm just sort of playing out way as I go. But uh, I th it looks like it's a lot better quality camera. And uh, you can actually see my figures a lot better. Um, I really enjoy painting them up. Um, I'm trying new things of horses and stuff like that, and um, it's just trial and error. And the more I paint, the more I better I think I'm becoming myself. And um, you know, I, mean, I can sort of fire them out pretty fast. I've got uh, um, the new uh, Perry's. Um, Napoleonic Russian horse artillery, two guns of them and crew for horse battery, which I'm going to paint up and um, get them done this week. Hopefully, um, I've got three days of got public holiday here in Dublin, in Ireland, um, on Monday, so I've got a bit of time I can whip in and actually get them finished. And I've done a video and show you what they look like when they're done. They are a few beautiful sculpts, the new ones. Um, I got some of their old uh, Russian point artillery and um, the Perry, for the Perry brothers and uh, the new stuff even looks even nicer. Um, so yeah, so I'm really happy with it. So so after I've done that horse artillery, I've got 12 skirmishes to do as well, and then my Russian pikes are pretty much done. Um, I mean, you know, it's a war game and nothing's ever finished. Um, but um, but I think I'll stop my pikes for the for a while and get, get cracking into the finishing the Spanish Civil War. Um, I've got this as you can see this mat here. This is, a, this is part of my gr green table, which I'm generic table. But I really want to do one for Spain and Italy. Um, the table, um, which can be twenty mil or twenty eight mil. Um, I see um, there's a couple of videos in there about Fat Frank's uh, roads, desert roads. I think I might buy a set of them and um, tart them up and use them for Spain, you know, um, and make a sort of a deserty type um, terrain. Um, that might be a bit of a plan to do in the next while. Um, we'll just see. Um, but yeah, so. The zoom looks good and, it, and the camera looks like it's focusing nicely. Um, give you guys a good look at the figures. Um, yeah, so uh, thanks guys and um, I'll uh, put some other videos up soon. When I've done this artillery I'll put one up and show you what I've done. Thanks guys. Righto. Bye.